hi everyone welcome back in this cake php video tutorial we are gonna learn how we can use the routing how we can uh, load the view and how we can pass the parameter in the uh, routing uh, so let's get started with that so first of all you can see that uh, this is our home page and and with this you can use the contact us so how we can do that so for that I am going to first of all just open the route routes.php file which is placed in the config dot config folder so here you can there is a lots of code so which is tell us that what and how the routing is going to work for that I am going to delete uh, these extra code so that we can understand a very easily all right so now this is a kind of small file and i'm going to delete some more folders so that we can create them again okay we don't need to uh, delete them so we just uh, so here you can see that we have a function uh, with the route and scope resolution method and here is it's calling the router builder uh, route builder function and here the main routing where you have to change and from where you can make the new routing is from here so even you can use the scope resolution method here and if you want to use the this one with the arrow method this is also fine so this is our the path parameter in the connect and in the array which is the second parameter first array for the controller second one which is given is the action is the function of the controller and third one is the home this is the extra parameter if you want to pass if you don't want to pass pass that's fine even if you want to use like this then this is also fine so now just go to the home uh, home controller uh, sorry page controller so that we can watch the architecture what what's going on here so here you can see that's a lots of code is also here so just delete the extra code so that we can understand the very clear in the very clear way so uh, before that if you just open the fresh project you will see the lots of code with the they are counting the paths and all if and if you if you just want to kick start it and don't want to understand the hazel this then you can uh, remove this one and just put this line here and this it, and it's going to work fine let's check okay this is going to working fine guys if you are not showing showing uh, this page uh, and first moment and if you are uh, finding the not found url then you have to watch our previous video and here we just changed in the more rewrite file and it's very quick and easy video so you can watch from here also so okay so let's get uh, continue with this video okay so now how we can create the new new router so for now just copy this one so that we can do it the very quickly like you want to create a about controller and about uh, screen okay so you can put the about controller name whatever you want like I want to put the about and you can put the action 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 let's see we just going to write here display and we are not going to pass the extra parameter here okay so just go here for, for now and it will showing that you find nothing here and it it will going the uh, it it will go uh, showing the error message and let's now just start to create the new routers controller so just go to the controller folder which is placed in the src and create a new file which is the about controller do PHP so guys be careful that the first name of your file and the controller name is it they should be in the camel cases and because 
uh, this one identify the name of the router and it identify that this is the router this is the controller so all right so just copy and paste the small code here and write here about controller and about controller always inherit the app controller in kphp so we have the same folder we don't need this parameter for now and now the controller is fine now we have to create the view and the template for that just go to the src folder and here you see the template folder and here you first of all you have to create the about folder oops this is not the folder actually it's my bad it's created the file all right so now just create the folder here which is the about nice and in the about just create a file name display why display because of action name is display here ctp this is the uh, cake template page all right so here you can write the php html whatever you want like about a space all right and now just go here and refresh it so you can see that we are here about a screen so these and you are seeing that what is that these are coming from the by default uh, which is the uh, by default screen we can remove if, if you want from this okay so let's repeat uh, let's uh, once again see that what we did that we just create the controller here and we pass the controller name sorry uh, uh, router name and uh, here the second parameter is the controller name and then second one is the action name and if, if you want to put the uh, parameter if you can put here like this and if you don't want to put then that's okay and now we want to uh, we have to create the about controller in the src controller folder with the camel case in the about and con with prefix controller.php and here we just create the display dot display function and this is a router is completed now now we have to create the uh, view for that just go to the template here just create the same name name as the controller name which is the about and now uh, after the folder just create the display.ctp which is same name as the function and that's it okay so now let's suppose you want to pass some parameter here so you can pass like this so just pass a star here and go to the your controller and here you can see that mm, just pass here parameter with that data oops that's my bad echo this one echo dollar data and this will print your parameter here oops so you can see that we got the parameter here and sometime if you are very uh, we are if we did not pass the parameter then what happened so you can use the true controller like this if you remove this one okay so there is some issue let me check out what's going on uh -uh. okay so the issue is that because we pass the parameter here also so we can use a different function if you are going to pass the uh, if we are going to pass the uh, parameter like this so let's check for so it's fine and if you if you are if you are going to pass the parameter you can use a different function like display 
x y z or you can do this one also like dollar data equal to null this will also work i think so let's check it's working or not yes this this is working with that one and if i pass this 10 here and that's it's still working so thanks guys thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of confusion with the routing you can put me in the comment box and uh, if you have any kind of suggestion if you have any kind of issue you can write me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe our channel and find the, our facebook link in the description box thanks guys thanks for watching this video